Welcome to Alive and Juicy. I'm Chef Dr. Deandra, a naturopath and raw food chef. And I'm in the kitchen today to show you how to make some delectable treats for our four-legged friends. If you'd like to feed, learn how to feed your dog raw and watch a video on how to make the simple basic raw dog food, you can do that at my website www.aliveandjuicy.com or on the Squidoo page, Raw Pets. So today we're going to be making some chicken treats using prunes and apples. You can also use mangoes, papayas, bananas, and any other sweet fruit that you think your animal will love. The easiest for me to work with, however, are the prunes and apples. So we're going to take a pitted prune, we're going to cut it in half lengthwise, and we're going to take an apple, a sweet apple, Red Delicious, Gala, Fuji, any of your sweet apples, and cut it right around the core. Go right around the core. Then take the piece and slice it into approximately quarter inch half moons. So they're about a quarter inch and they're about half moons. And that's what we're going to wrap the chicken around. Now for me, using the breast tenders from Trader Joe's and all natural meat is one of the easiest and quickest things to do. However, it's not the only meat you can use. You can use beef, you can use chicken livers, you can use beef livers, you can use turkey, you can use light meat or dark meat. It's just this seems to be the fastest and easiest. So take the pieces that have already been de-skinned and de-boned and place them on your board. With a meat cleaver, we're going to ham or we're going to pound them out, but not too thin, about a quarter of an inch. Basically, the cleavering is just to flatten them and even them out. And here's my friend, a nine-year-old standard poodle. It's a good idea to let your, let your animals help you. And the small pieces that you can't wrap, they can just eat right up. And they love making their own treats. Okay, we're just going to slice these into thin strips. Probably about, again, about a quarter inch and as long as possible. When you have the little pieces that don't work and won't wrap, such as this, just go ahead and feed it to your pet. It makes them engaged in what you're doing and love their treats even more. We're going to just take an apple and wrap the meat right around the apple. Place it on your dehydrator sheet. And again, a piece of apple, a strip of meat, wrap it right around the apple and place it on your dehydrator sheet. Same thing with your prunes. We're going to take a strip. Wrap it around your prune, place it on your dehydrator sheet. Fill your entire dehydrator sheet and then put it in the dehydrator 130 degrees for the first two hours and 115 degrees for about another 10 hours. When, you're, when they're finished, the meat will be dry and the apples or the bananas will be soft. The animals truly love them. They last a long time. I like to keep mine in the refrigerator, but you don't necessarily have to. So there you go. Some quick and easy, nutritious, and again, delicious raw animal treats. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.